And in terms of, I've had a question about uh, gathering impulse responses. Again, just to kind of uh, get a feel for, the, again, the reverb aspect for, say, if you're then trying to drop in something else that you've done, say, in a studio. Is that is that quite common? Um, you know, I did that on Noah, um, on on the movie Noah. We did a lot of uh, sort of uh, nature recording for Noah. And what uh, Craig Hennigan, the sound designer, he said to me is, you know what? Like everybody has in clean interior impulse responses, um, but there's like almost no exterior, you know, responses. So what he asked me to do was go through and every location we recorded outside record the impulse responses. So what we did is we brought a speaker with us. Um, like a big speaker, a big JBL, plugged it in, uh, had 100 foot um, uh, power cable, and then we used a, a um, task cam recorder to play back the, the tones, the impulse tones into the speaker. And then all, as our mics were already set up for sound effects recording, we recorded the impulse tones. So some of them were on mic, some of them were off mic, pointed at different reflections in the in on the mountains and in the uh, you know the terrains that we were recording. Um, uh, now, I didn't use them personally, um, but um, so I have no idea, honestly, uh, how they turned out because you know we just did the recording. I could ask Craig though and, and get back to you. Uh, 